it in the air. So. That might be dangerous though, I'm yeah, not yeah. sure about that. There you go, yeah. <laughs> oh, that's sick! I don't need yeah. I won't even work there. <laughs> Do it, do it, do anything you want to do. I love it. Perfect. <laughs> That's a great job. You come with that. Mental strength is perhaps the greatest strength inside of a cross country athlete. It is a strength that lives within everyone. However, it is up to every individual to decide whether they can let that mental strength shine brighter than the Mississippi sun or merely leave it in the dark. Everybody on the cross country team, they love to run. So, you know, staying positive and just, just realizing that you're out there to have a good time. And, you know, that, that's for me and for the majority of this team especially is the most important part of distance running. Life as a distance runner requires a year-round commitment to your body and mind and following back-to-back -back trips to the NCAA championships for the men and a rising women's program, fourth-year assistant coach Ryan Van Oy felt it was important to provide the student athletes with an opportunity to let their hair down and enjoy all the wonders of Mother Nature. Oh, hey guys, what's going on? What's up, man? You guys are perfect. We're just all hanging out yeah, in the living room watching some Olympics. Last night we won a, a potluck contest. A potluck contest. I got a shepherd's pie with pulled pork in it. So kitchen's a bit of a mess. We need to clean that up. Slim is sleeping. He's very tired. <laughs> Now we move people in here. We got Ben. Who do I share this with, Mark? We got two freshmen here. Now, let's take it back out. This is one of my favorite rooms. Down here, we have the hot water heater. <laughs> we definitely need this. You want a warm shower? We definitely need a hot water heater. Bedroom one. You step down here. You got your seltzer water. You want to stay hydrated? You got your coconut water. Now you're rolling. <laughs> I think that's about it. in the river with you know 40 40 plus kayaks a little hectic at first but you know there were some people that were you know trying to sprint ahead and I guess you know finish the course a little faster and then there were you know people in the back who weren't paddling at all and then there were a couple people who were just hiding in the river waiting to flip everybody so you know it wasn't you weren't staying dry on that trip just here in the river with the crew 
at Pickwick Lake in Tennessee, just enjoying the trip so far. Uh, today we've just had a short run and you know enjoying the kayak trip you now down the river. We just came through a lot of rain just there, a lot of fun. Having your friends side by sides turn what most people would consider, you know, um, a laborious chore or, or just something that's, you know, not exactly fun into like, you know, one of my favorite things to do. I really enjoyed the Pickwick Lake trip. This is the first time we did it and I'm a junior and I just, if we could have done it the my freshman and sophomore year, I wish we could have because it was so fun and I think it was just a great way for everyone to get to know each other. Go Manny, go. Oh, crunches. Oh, that's what I was gonna do. Sorry, Zach. <laughs> Teamwork makes a dream work. <laughs> We're gonna do the runner. Oh, I knew uh, it. Right? I knew it. Shocker. We'll show the new people the runner. All right, so. You're going to start in a seated position like most of us are already in. Your feet are going to be in front of you bent at the knee. You're going to keep your head straight, your eyes forward. And you're just going to run with your upper body as if you're on a run. That trip was a lot more than just, you know, let's go, let's go find some good trails to run. You know, we, we had a volleyball tournament, we had a cook-off. So it was nice to just get everybody together and, and with, rather than you know just practicing together, it was like you know we were we were there for three days, just hanging out, having a good time. This year has been a lot of firsts for Old Miss. We had that first cross country trip. We have a track finally, you know, just got finished yesterday, I think. and now we're having our first home cross country meet in I think three or four years. So we're really excited as a program to you know, get out there and host some schools. I'm so excited for our first cross country meet here. I'm a junior, so I've, we've never had a home cross country meet while I've been here. We do get so much support from everybody, but it, it will be awesome to get to see people come out there and watch cross country. It'll be really cool to see teammates and people from Oxford and everyone just come out and show us support.